Okay, this is a quick and easy way to update your Game Shark or Pro or Action Replay or whatever version two cartridge you have, knockoff, whatever, with uh, whatever firmware you want. So the one I have is a Game Shark 2.0. It's currently flashed, so I don't need to do a swap trick to to make this work. But normally, if you don't have it already flashed, you need to do a swap trick with Game Shark unplugged. <coughs> So what you need is a uh, regular PlayStation disc. I got Resident Evil 2. And you need the extra ROMs that you need to update your thing. And you need this to boot it up so you can get at those ROMs. Xflash 1.2 Beta 3 by Firefly. If you don't use this CD here, you, uh, <coughs> you need to... Uh, make your own and you need like Windows 95 to do it right so it's pretty impossible <laughs> to find a computer that old so all you gotta do is start it up I got Action Replay this EMS version 1.55 or whatever with stop CD spin you take that one out you put this one in and this is the version with all the German uh, ROMs or IS or yeah, ROMs, you would call them. And then you just hit start game. Then that will load up like that. And then <coughs> what you do next is you pop the CD out, put it aside, and then you pop that CD in, and then you hit start. And the Firefly one has like a bunch of German I or ROMs, and uh, it has it has a uh, <coughs> KTLA uh, uh, three, four, and three, five. So this is the CD I made with the extra ROMs that I wanted to play with. So we start with the first one, and you just hit X, and it'll update it. And you hit start to exit, and then hit over to reset, and there you go. This is the Action Replay version 3.3 .3 Innovation. And then if you want to uh, update again, you just gotta go through the process again. So I have to put in Resident Evil, hit reset, wait for it to load. Wait for it to stop. Take it out. That one in. Hit over to start. Then that will load up. And pop that out. Pop in my RAM disk. And then hit start. And for these to work too, I think they need to be decrypted. Most of the third party ones or whatever are decrypted because the Game Shark 2.0 one I got there, it's not decrypted so it won't work. And this, the site I got this off it recommends that you don't uh, use 2.4 because you need the easy CD recovery or whatever to get back. So I'll try Zippy next. It's going to update. <clears throat> This is the only way I can figure out how to do this because every other way is like you need the comms link to make it work. And then there you go. CP version 0 0.33. And I don't find much of a difference between these, but because the way burners work now, they burn at 24x max and 10x minimum, so you can't burn at 2 or 3, 2 or 4x anymore, so. It's a bit hard to get some of the games to play without being choppy. Yeah. But uh, yeah, that's all there is to it and pretty much I'll show you the contents of that other CD before I turn this off. So hit reset with Resident Evil in, load Zippy.
Okay, I didn't think it was going to stop. And then if I put in the Firefly disc, which is in there. Okay. For some reason it always says detect the problems, explore, hit R2 to detect it or whatever. And then when I go to the RAM selection menu this time, without putting my dummy disc in, this is what comes up. And releases 0 01 to 0 07 don't work on version 2 cards. If you try to flash with these, it will, uh, <coughs> it will say it just, uh, to give you an error and it would say not successful or whatever. And if you reset out of this menu without putting Katila 3.4 on or 3.5. I find 3.5 didn't work with this one either, but it loads. It just wouldn't play nothing. Uh, but if you put 3.4 on, if you exit before you put it on, the game shark could be pretty much dead. And you'll have to go, you'll just have to do the swap trick to get back into it or whatever. So you can reflash it. And the method with putting the dummy disc in will also work with it as well. So I guess that's it. It's pretty easy. It's not very hard. And uh, hopefully this will help a lot of people out. Because I've had a lot of frustration trying to figure out a way to do this. And this is the only way I could think of to do it. <laughs> Thanks.